In a world where power and passion collided, an epic love story unfolded, transcending time and etching itself into the annals of history. The union of Julius Caesar and Cleopatra created a legendary tale that continues to captivate audiences today. Their passionate romance, fueled by ambition and desire, defied the odds, leaving an indelible mark on the ancient world and shaping the course of history. Let's delve into their remarkable story. Picture this, it's the year 48 BCE, and the formidable Roman general Julius Caesar arrives in Egypt as part of his campaign against his rival Pompey the Great. Seeking sanctuary, Pompey fled to Egypt, but met a tragic end when the young pharaoh Ptolemy the Thede ordered his execution, presenting his severed head to Caesar as a misguided attempt to win favor. Rather than pleased, Caesar was horrified by this act of betrayal. Amid the complex political landscape in Egypt, Caesar was about to encounter a woman who would forever change his life, Cleopatra, the enigmatic and alluring last pharaoh of ancient Egypt. Cleopatra daringly smuggled herself into Caesar's palace in Alexandria, concealed within an ornate carpet. Unrolling the carpet, Caesar was instantly captivated by her striking beauty and astute intellect. Cleopatra was no ordinary queen. A brilliant strategist and polyglot fluent in multiple languages, she possessed wit, charm, and cunning. A fiercely independent ruler, she refused to submit to the will of any man. However, Julius Caesar was no ordinary man either. As an accomplished conqueror and charismatic leader, he had triumphed in numerous battles, accumulating immense wealth and influence throughout the Roman Empire. Despite their considerable age difference, Caesar was 52 while Cleopatra was only 22. They found themselves irresistibly drawn to each other. Their mutual attraction grew stronger as they spent more time together, sharing their cultural backgrounds, perspectives, and a hunger for politics and power. Love was inevitable. Caesar assisted Cleopatra in reclaiming her throne after she was deposed by her own brother, Ptolemy the Mentern. Together, they waged a civil war that culminated in the Battle of the Nile in 47 BCE, resulting in Cleopatra's reinstatement as ruler. During their time together, they conceived a son named Caesarion. Their passionate liaison scandalized the ancient world. Caesar, already married to Calpurnia, faced criticism from the Roman elite when he brought Cleopatra to Rome. Undeterred, he continued to support her, even declaring Caesarion as his heir, further igniting controversy and inflaming tensions in Rome. However, their fabled love story would meet a tragic end. In 44 BCE, Caesar was assassinated by his own senators, leaving Cleopatra devastated and vulnerable. Seeking to secure her position and her son's future, she formed an alliance with Mark Antony, another influential Roman general and a staunch supporter of Caesar. Unfortunately, their alliance proved short-lived, and in 31 BCE, they suffered a crushing defeat at the Battle of Actium against Caesar's adopted son and successor, Octavian. Faced with defeat and capture, Cleopatra and Mark Antony chose to take their own lives. Cleopatra, in a final act of defiance, is believed to have committed suicide by inducing the bite of an asp while Mark Antony fell on his own sword. Caesarion, their son, was captured and executed on Octavian's orders. Despite the tumultuous and ultimately tragic nature of their relationship, Julius Caesar and Cleopatra remain one of history's most captivating and iconic couples.